What is up, you guys? My name is Mary. I'm with High Priestess Intuition. Welcome, my current subscribers, and welcome, 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 newbies. If you guys are new to my channel and you enjoy my content, if you can ring the bell, I'd super duper appreciate it. Just saying. Um, this is a Truth Hidden series for the sign of Aries. Um, I usually I start caps down, but I basically just I was doing some meditating here a minute ago. I was sitting here relaxing, chilling, my kitties, and um, doing some meditating. I basically heard from Spirit to do Aries. So, I'm doing Aries. Um, I did a collective reading earlier today. <clears throat> Excuse me. I heard um, from Spirit to do a collective. So, I did. But, apparently, there's a reason I need to do Aries. So, I'm going to. Um, just throwing that out there. Let me um, shuffle the cards. I hope everybody's doing okay today. For real, for real, for real. Um, this could resonate in your Aries. Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North Node, Midhaven, or Jupiter charts. Just throwing that out there. Um, you, this is a general truth hidden for the sign of Aries. So you only take the messages that resonate with you. That is super duper duper important. Just saying. Because I had a bunch, a bunch of pissed off Scorpios last month commenting on my um, channel. Talking about um, they were pissed off because the re uh, reading not was not specifically tailored for them. Well, my goodness, you didn't, I mean, you didn't pay for a personal reading. It's a general reading. I have no nothing about your personal life. I know no date of births. I know no situations. So, I mean, how, I don't know how you expect it to be personalized to you. I'm just saying. So, take the messages that only resonate with you. Just saying. And this is Truth Hidden Series. So, it's basically what they don't want you to know for the sign of Aries. <clears throat> this can resonate in your Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North Node, Midhaven, or Jupiter charts. Just throwing that out there. All right, we're going to get started. If I see you're hearing anything, I'll let you know. I haven't got any messages in yet. But I heard to do this one first, so I am. Spirit, what messages do you have for the sign of Aries? I might throw some tarot cards here, here in the, at the end. Just letting so y'all know. Stalker. Breakfast. And lunch. I didn't hear a verse. I didn't hear a verse. Okay. Okay, I just heard stalks you on social media during their um their um breaks is what I just heard. Stalks you on social media during their during their breaks. So for how that resonates. And I, I know I just, I think I just said it, but I want to read it, read it, read it. This could resonate in your Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North Node, Midhaven, or Jupiter charge. I think I just said that, but I'm just saying. Sorry, y'all, I'm cold. I know it's like August, but just saying. I heard uh, stalks your social media during lunch break. I mean, during breaks. So I'm assuming that's breaks at work, obviously. Um, or if they run a business during, you know, their breaks running their business um, for who this resonates with. And I strongly feel it is an Aries that's being stalked. Yes. Yes. I just heard yes from Spirit. Okay. So it's an Aries being stalked um, and someone stalking you, Aries, on your social media during um, their breaks. Heavy stalking. Beware. That's what I just heard. Heavy stalking. Beware. Ooh, Aries. So beware, somebody's heavily stalking you. Oof. Let me see if I hear anything else. I didn't. Oh, yikes. Be careful. Okay, this one just literally just came in just now. Someone is about to be a part of a class action lawsuit against another individual. Someone is about to be a part of a class action lawsuit against another individual. <clears throat> you know, class action lawsuits, usually they're against companies, usually. Because, um, <clears throat> you know, it's a class action um, is a band of... A group of people several several people involved in the lawsuit against usually a company 
um, but it can be against a person um, that wronged apparently a ton of people. But I heard someone, apparently some Aries is going to be a part of a class action lawsuit against her person. So for how that resonates. And if y'all think anybody could benefit from these messages, anybody needs to hear or um, or wants to hear these or needs to hear these, if you wouldn't mind uh, sharing these on your social media platforms that you use, like Facebook, Snapchat, Twitter, Instagram, IG, whatever you use, I would super appreciate it. Just saying. <clears throat> Chill vibes. Fire sign. Favor. And travel. Not stalking the fire sign anymore is what I just heard. Not stalking the fire sign anymore is what I just heard. Or using black magic on them is what I just heard. So, for whatever Aries this resonates with, you're not stalking a fire sign anymore. And you're not using uh, black magic on them anymore. So, for however that resonates. Um, but you have chill vibes now. Life is a lot more peaceful now. Well, yeah, I bet it is. I mean, why would you stalk anybody to begin with? Um, I bet it is more peaceful. My goodness. Fire signs are Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. Uh, for anybody that doesn't know. that I'm sure, assuming that's why it's reversed, obviously. Um... Very soon is what I just heard very soon. And I have the favor card. So I'm assuming that goes with this. And that was upright. So someone's going to be asking you for a favor very soon. Very soon. Very, very soon. Okay. So for who this resonates with. Um, <clears throat> someone's going to be asking you for a favor very, very soon. And you're not traveling. I didn't hear anything. Man, I was hoping it would. I didn't hear anything. Okay. But you're not traveling in some type of way. Um, maybe you're saving your money. Maybe you're a uh, can't. Uh, maybe you're stuck in a legal situation. I didn't hear that. That's just what I'm assuming. Um, first, how would that resonate? So it could resonate in a million different ways for moving different people. So, Earth and chart is what I just heard. Earth and chart. So, obviously, you have Aries in your chart somewhere, whether it's Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North Node, Midhaven, or Jupiter. But apparently, you have Earth in your chart, too. And Earth signs are Taurus, Capricorn, Virgo. So, you either have Taurus, Capricorn, or Virgo somewhere else in your chart. For um, this to resonate with you. Okay. <clears throat> you get some more. Someone is camping right now. That's what I just heard. Someone is camping right now. Well, that's awesome. I love to camp. I love to take my kids. We haven't done it in a while, but hopefully soon, you know. Um, that's amazing. That's wonderful. Spirit, what messages um, do you have for the sign Aries? So I guess in that last one, what they don't want you to know, Aries, is um, someone's going to be asking you for a favor soon. I mean, I think you were the one that was stalking the fire sign, but I think what they don't want you to know is someone's about to ask you for a favor. Legal issues coming up is what I just heard just now. And I haven't got these cards out yet. So I'm assuming with this one... Uh, Apparently, what they don't want you to know as well with this one is um, you're about to have legal issues coming up. Yes. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I just heard yes. I just heard confirmation from spirit. Okay, so yes. Legal issues coming up with this one. I was wondering. I was like, what the crap? Okay. And the first one you know is what they don't want you to know is they're talking to you on their um, lunch breaks, I'm assuming. Okay. Nail salon venting, talking about issues, revenge, looking you up. Okay. Doesn't want revenge anymore, is what I just heard. Doesn't want revenge anymore, so I'm assuming these are reversed. 
Yes. Ooh, I just heard yes. Okay, so it doesn't want whatever areas this resonates with. They don't want revenge anymore. Um, they're looking you up, and I guess they're not venting about um, wanting revenge on you or not. maybe not shit-talking you um, because they don't want revenge anymore. Apparently, at one time, they did. Um, but they've been looking you up, researching you, studying you, and getting information on you. Romantically interested in you is what I just heard. Romantically interested in you. So, so uh, and I'm assuming that's why. Um, there was some weird, uh, maybe they've always been, I didn't hear this, but maybe they've always been romantically interested in you. So they wanted revenge in the past because you wasn't with them. <clears throat> and they wanted revenge on you because you didn't obviously give them what they wanted in the romantic department, I'm assuming. Maybe it's just for a few of you. Um... But now they're past the revenge stage, and they just want they want to they want to get to you. I guess not in a creepy um, Uncle Joe kind of way. Um, so they're trying to do it the right way to get in with you on the good side. Taurus and chart is what I just heard. Taurus and chart. <clears throat> so for whoever this resonates with. I'm thinking that for whatever Aries this resonates with, the person wanting to do this the right way now, they have Taurus in their chart. Now, wherever that is in their chart, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, North Node, Midhaven, or Jupiter chart, but somewhere in their chart. So just saying. And that's what they don't want you to know is they used to want huge revenge on you. Um, they sound, I mean, I didn't hear it, but they probably have been obsessed with you for a long freaking time. It's what it sounds like, and I'm sure they don't want you to know that either. Just saying. Um, you know, people don't like to display their bad sides. Um, everybody has them to, you know, some degree or another. But apparently they don't want to display their bad side. Of course they don't, because they want to get in with you and get a piece. I hate to say that, but just saying. Okay. Spirit, what messages do you have for the question? Someone, this one just came in just now. Someone is about to, some Aries is what I heard. Some Aries is about to be betrayed in a huge way. Okay. Some Aries is about to be betrayed in a huge way. That's what I just heard. Regarding the past. Regarding the past. That's what I just heard. Regarding the past. So for how that resonates, um, I, I don't know if it's masculine or feminine. Um, I, that's all I heard. Some Aries is about to be betrayed in a huge way regarding the past. So for how that resonates. Ooh. Filing for divorce. Got proof. Hustling. Oh, my God. No reversed. That's why I just heard. No reversed. Okay. Okay, this one just came in. Someone is about to provide your spouse very important evidence on you to get the divorce done, is what I just heard. Someone is about to provide your spouse, so an airy spouse. Someone is about to provide an airy spouse. Um, very important evidence, I heard, um, to go ahead and get the divorce done. So it's for a married Aries out there. Um, and someone else is about to provide um, evidence um, for the spouse to get the divorce done. The, 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 the delays are over, get her done. That's what I just heard. The delays are over, get her done. Now, I'm assuming that's a channel message from someone. I really don't think that's a spirit message. Um, but that's what I just heard. The delays are over, get her done. Obviously, it's with this one. Just saying. Okay, and that's obviously what they don't want you to know, Aries. Um, so that would make sense while we have filing for divorce upright. They're um, photo proof getting evidence. Um, someone is about to provide your spouse, I heard, with some evidence. Um, I'm assuming it's going to be very useful evidence for them to go ahead and get the divorce done. Um, and apparently they're working hard to get this done. And then I'm assuming when the spouse gets the um, evidence, they're really going to work hard to get it done. Yes, yes, yes. Okay. 
So you're either in the public eye or maybe your spouse is in the public eye or maybe the person providing information is in the public eye, but somebody's in the public eye, whether it's you or the person providing information or your spouse or all three of you or just a couple, however that resonates. It's going to be very high profile is what I just heard. It's going to be very high profile is what I just heard. So I guess the divorce is going to be very high profile or maybe the evidence is going to be very high profile. How that resonates. Oh, Lord Aries. A series of chain of events is going to occur. That's what I heard with this one. A series of chain of events is going to occur that's really not going to be good for the Aries, is what I just heard. A series of chain of events is going to occur that's really not going to be good for the Aries. The delays are over. I just heard that again. The delays are over. I heard that twice with this one, Aries. So apparently there has been a lot of stagnant energy regarding this divorce. Um, I guess people haven't stepped up or maybe there wasn't cold hard evidence um, provided, which it sounds like the spouse don't have the evidence right now, but apparently there is evidence out there and somebody's gonna step up and provide this um, spouse with evidence to be able to get this divorce done very efficiently, and, um, you know, properly. Um, but apparently there was a lot of stagnant energy. Maybe people didn't want to step up or maybe they just didn't have the evidence to step up, but now they, they, someone's going to, which is gonna cause a chain of events. Heard it's gonna be very high profile. So for how that resonates. An Aries relationship with a Libra is about to really come into the public eye is what I just heard. An Aries personal relationship. Okay, I heard that at the end. An Aries personal relationship is about to really come into the public eye with a Libra. So for how that resonates. You know, it could be Aries, obviously, in your sun, moon, rising, Venus, north node, midheaven, or Jupiter. Same for Libra. So for how that resonates. But I heard it's there. Apparently, whoever this resonates with, an Aries and a Libra, they had a personal relationship, um, like a private relationship. But I'm assuming nobody really knew about it, or not a lot of people knew about it. But apparently, now it's really going to be exposed into the public eye. Mean woman reversed, burning evidence, trash reversed. No, no reversed. That's why I just heard no reversed. So obviously, I was going to say real quick before we move on to this one. Obviously, in this one, Aries, what they don't want you to know is um, basically um, you're about to get slammed with a divorce, and your spouse is about to obviously get evidence to slam you with it. Obviously. And for some of you, it could resonate with, uh, it could you could be involved with Libra and that could have been the person that, you know, the evidence could have been the personal relationship with the Libra or that could resonate different for different folks. Okay, heard no reverse, so mean woman upright, burning evidence and trash. Let's see, try and see if I hear anything. Okay. She's really been down talking you lately is what I just heard. She's really been down talking you lately. Trying to cover up the fact you helped her use black magic is what I just heard. Trying to cover up the fact that she, she, you helped her use black magic is what I just heard. So for how that resonates for whatever Aries, um, I heard she's been down talking you a lot lately and she's been um, basically um, covering, trying to cover up the fact that you helped her use black magic. Um, so apparently for whatever Aries this resonates with, you helped someone use black magic on somebody or just helped a person use black magic, how that resonates. But it's a mean woman you helped use black, you helped, the person you helped use black magic on or the help, the person you helped with the black magic, however that resonates. It can resonate a million different ways, but you help someone use black magic. Maybe you gave them information on how to use black magic or you 
cast some kind of help them cast some kind of spell on someone or however that resonates but the person you helped is a mean woman i heard they've really been down talking to you lately they think you are beneath them they think you are beneath them is what i just heard that's awful um and i think that's why trash is here they think that you are beneath them so i think they think you're trash which is awful you should never think that way about anybody and I, they're trying to cover up the fact you helped them use black magic so i think they're trying to burn some kind of evidence regarding that libra in chart is what i just heard libra in chart so they have libra in their chart the person you helped um, whether it's sun moon rising venus north node midhaven or jupiter charts yikes okay all right well i think i'm gonna close it here we're at 21 minutes um okay I want to tell you guys real quick, um, I'm doing a deck giveaway for anybody that doesn't know, the newbies that are just coming in. Um, I'm going to pick a, two random winners um, September 1st, okay? It's a deck giveaway similar to what Sit Star 555 does if anybody watches her. Um, but I'm randomly picking a winner, excuse me, on September 1st. So you need to enter now. All you have to do with that is just comment on one of the videos or comment on my Facebook anywhere that you're interested in entering for the deck giveaway from my tarot card reading channel, High Priestess Intuition. Um, and then there's two parts. That's part one. And then part two is sharing one of my videos off of my Facebook onto any of your social media platforms. That's part two. You have to share it off my Facebook to your social media platform. And the reason that is is because if you share it off my Facebook, I get notification you shared it. So that would be, I know you completed part two. That's why. So, um, just saying. Um, so, I will enter your name on my little handy dandy list after you've done both parts. And then I will randomly um, select a winner on September 1st. And these are the decks, Earth Magic. I use both of these in a lot of my daily teas, the daily energy checks. Um, they're really awesome decks. This is Earth Magic. And this is some examples of the cards. I use them a lot. This is the back. That's Earth Magic. And this is Energy. This is one of my recent new ones. And example of cards. Oops. Completely free. You know, it's a giveaway. But you have to complete both parts. You have to um, share. I mean, I'm sorry, you have to comment that you're interested. And then you have to share a video on from my Facebook to any of your social media platforms. Now, I don't care which video you share, just one of my videos, my, one of my tarot card reading videos. Um, and that's it, that's all you gotta do. Alrighty, well, we're done, 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 done. I will see you guys later and namaste.